Here we are at 115 Carmel Circle. Just giving you kind of a spin of what's around us. That's the neighbor's house. Cleaning ladies across the street at that house. The beautiful pin oaks up and down all of Carmel Circle. Got a big two car garage. I went ahead and opened the door. So I'm going to go in this way. Obviously needs to be painted and cleaned and all that good stuff. Um, big deep garage. Uh, that's where your HVAC system, hot water heater, that sort of thing's all in this closet. But there's still some, a little bit of storage room in here. And then you've got, uh, this one's dedicated all to storage. You can reorganize shelves if you want to, but a nice good size closet there. Just have some pegboard. We'll probably clean all that up unless y'all want to keep it. Um, we usually just strip it all down and paint it all and then start from scratch. Uh, but a nice window door. Um, exterior door going into the kitchen. I like that feature. Most of them have a solid door there. We come in straight to the mudroom. Um, it's got the um, side by sides here. Good cabinets all the way up to the nine foot ceilings, crown mold. Um, obviously the whole kitchen is going to be redone, cabinets are repainted, um, countertops replaced, uh, pools and everything replaced, all your appliances will be replaced. You can pick out your fridge and uh, get a microwave hood combo. This will be a flat finish surface stove. Flooring will be replaced, sinks, um, even your water fixtures, lights. Uh, everything um, gets fixed in here and replaced. I think mean, it's even got lights above the cabinets. It's pretty cool. We've never seen that one before. Um, and then this is walked from the kitchen uh, into the dining area. They've stripped it down to concrete floors. There's a pocket door here, which is nice. It just comes in and out real nicely. All your fixtures will be replaced. This is now that dining area, there's the front door coming in. There's a fixture there that you can replace, obviously. Um, that's going to the living room. That's back where we came from the kitchen. Um, it's going towards the bedrooms. This is the guest bath. It has a nice high sink already. But all again, all the cabinets and pools and fixtures and all will be replaced. That's the shower, you're, it's a tub now, you're talking about making it a shower. It does have a nice skylight in here, which brings a lot of good natural light in. It's got some cabinets, again, all this stuff will be redone. Um, this is the guest bedroom. Um, good size guest bedroom, big windows. Uh, and then two uh, closets that kind of run the length of that wall, which is nice. Um, you see lots of plugs, cable outlets. Uh, telephone outlets, all that stuff. Um, again, there's that bathroom we just saw. This is the master side. Good size. You've got uh, two big windows and you can see the backyard nicely here. It's got a lot of privacy. Um, this is the master closet. Again, good size. We can help you arrange the shelving if you don't like this style. Um, it's got a pocket door there pocket door here and commode it's got your skylight in here nice big uh, bathroom for us again all of it the hinges will be hidden um, knobs will be redone it's got a nice uh, walk-in shower with a seat and all in it and it's got some linen storage there the tons and tons of storage space is abundant and again it's all going to be repainted and everything is redone in there. Then we run into <clears throat> the living area. It's just kind of dark. Need some light fixtures in here. But you got a nice look at the fireplace going. Got a mantle. It's got your um, your built-ins on either side. There and there. So nice cathedral ceilings in here ceiling fan there's some existing can lights but we can again put kind of what you want in here 
And this goes in the Carolina room, which has some, some built-ins there, but they're, again, need to be repainted and reworked and everything. Um, and then it's got a little patio out here. Obviously, it's a mess right now, but uh, there's that big hedge in the back. Some nice trees and all. And then you go into the office space or den, whatever you want to call it. There's no light in here right now, so it's so dark. But of course, we can put ceiling fans, light fixtures, put plugs wherever you want them. Um, but yeah, probably one of the nicer houses in all the West of Commons. Um, and um, I'll send you some details. Thanks.